issues. We will, the parliament session is going to start on the 17th. We will be raising high prices. We will be raising the issue of inflation uh, in parliament. We will ask for an entire debate on this. We want the government to produce a white paper on high prices and those demands will continue to be. We have fought at petrol pumps. We have protested all across the country. We do hope that the media will show the plight of the people because you belong to the section. You are the fourth pillar of democracy. And the price rise under which India is reeling today is unprecedented. Prices hurt the common man, but they hurt the common man even more when the GDP growth is low, when wages have been cut, when jobs have been lost, when businesses have been shut. I only want to end by saying that one line, if you remember, there was a Peeply Live movie. And uh, at least when we were in power, the BJP could keep playing that song. Uh, it says, Mahangai Dayan Khaye Jaat Hai. Mahangai Abhi Bhi Kha Rahi Hai. Abhi Bhi Woh Dayan Se Lekin Inke Liye Darling Ban Gai Hai. Mahangai Ab Dayan Bilkul Nahi Hai BJP Ke Liye. Bajpa Ke Logon Ko, Pradhan Mantri Mohde Ko, Lagta Hai Ki Woh Pradhan Mantri Awas Me Baiht Kar, Karodo Rupay Aapne Upar Kharcha Karte Hai, 8000 Karodo Ka Hawaii Jahaj Kharitte Hai, 20000 Karodo Rupay Ka Central Vista Banate Hai. Shayad Unko Logon Ki Garibi, Unka Dikkat, Unki Majboori Nahi Dikh Rahi Hai. लेकिन अगर वो अपने राज सिंहासन छोड़ के बाहर निकलेंगे, he will see people are very worried, people are really reeling under the burden burden of high prices and they need some respite. I'll take questions first on Suomoto, please. I will first take questions on this. If there are any questions on inflation, then I'll come to population control. Sorry, sir? What type of agitation is it? Or we, anger? No, I, uh, beside, I think more than anger, uh, the plight of the people is unmissable. I think one needs to pay attention to how worried and how uh, miserable the lives of people have been. So I don't think anger is the right word. As far as parliament is concerned, we will take it up in parliament before the government. We will uh, demand uh, an entire discussion, and we hope that the government will produce a white paper on the economy, including inflation. So you will stall the proceedings? Uh, sir, I said we will demand a discussion on this. I never said we will stall proceedings. I think there are ways to bring the government to agree to things. Uh, I think the elected government of the day should be conscious of what the people are going through, and only then uh, those matters can be taken up in parliament. Uh, disruption, according to the late Sharon Jaitley ji, is a is a method in a democracy to attract attention. That's not what we want to do. But if the government chooses to be mute and duff to the plight of the people, we will leave no stone unturned to raise this issue in parliament. Any other question on this? Your question on population. There is a lot that is being written and said about population. I think the lot that has not been written also needs to be pointed out. India's total fertility rate, which is number of children being produced by a couple, has consistently gone down. It used to be 5.6 in the 1950s, so a woman was producing almost 5.6 children. It has considerably gone down across states, and it's actually down to 2.1. So a couple, on an average, is producing 2.1 children, which is almost the same as replacement level. Now, what is replacement level? If two people die in one generation, there are 2.1 to replace them. So in an ideal situation, the number of people dying should be replaced by the number of people coming in, and then that finds a balance. In our country, there are some states where the total fertility rate is as, as low as one, and there are innumerable states. There are some where it is up, but not astronomically up. Even for Bihar, it is just three. In Uttar Pradesh, it is 2.7. This is a ploy to once again divide the people. This is the ploy to once again distract from major issues. What are the major issues of the day? The major issues of the day are price rise. The major issues of the day are joblessness. The major issues of the day are high poverty. The major issues of the day are 23 crore people slipping below the poverty line. 
instead of addressing those issues it is your duty to create jobs it is your duty to ensure people are prosperous it is your duty to ensure that people don't slip below the poverty line it is your duty to ensure that every indian is well provided for does not go to bed hungry instead of doing that you want to bring up another issue to distract and that is the only ploy the reality is that in 80 years india's population will be down to 100 crores from the 140 crores we are today by 2100 we will be down to 100 crores naturally so our population will rise for 10 12 years and then we will go down i want to say our population was our dividend it was our biggest bet why do you think these multinationals why do you think these big companies came to india to invest because we gave them the market that they wanted our population was our biggest dividend which is what it was called the demographic dividend because of the mismanagement of the economy mismanagement of the policies because of the divisive nature of this government they are turning the demographic dividend into demographic disaster instead of creating jobs for the world's youngest nation you are actually telling people that don't do jobs instead stop producing children our population will go down on its own 200 crores 40 45 crore people will be wiped out because our total fertility rate is going down because people are producing less also scientific data tells you if people are more educated and if there is less poverty the population gets under control most educated couples have lesser children this is scientific data educate people make them less poor create more jobs and when why do a lot of people ask this question why do people create you know have so many children because you have no social security you have no job you feel you know if i have six children at least one will take care of me but when we are educated and when you have a job you believe i have to provide for these children they should become respectable adults they should find jobs they should be respectable in the society you will produce lesser children this scientific data across the world has proven this instead of doing that this is just a diversionary tactic and i will mince no words in saying this is not just diversionary this is also divisive because it's it's trying to attack it's trying to pinpoint on a certain community the reality is that children being produced in either of the two communities are being done in the same ratio again data that's produced by the government of india has proven this this is not data that's coming from me sure जी आई थिंक इट इज इंपॉर्टेंट दैट कमराज लाइक यू एंड द मीडिया स्टार्ट टॉकिंग अबाउट हाई प्राइसिस आई कम फ्रॉम मीडिया टिल अबाउट थ्री इयर्स बैक आई वॉज अ टेलीविजन एडिटर एंड एंकर आई हैव डन न्यूमरेबल शोज ऑन प्राइस राइज हाउ मेनी शो एंड आई नाउ गो रेग्यूलरली ऑन टीवी डिबेट्स एवरी इवनिंग आई रीड एटलीस्ट सिक्स न्यूज पेपर्स अ डे I don't see price rise being an issue and I'm not blaming you all I'm saying is it is a very big issue you will have to be the voice of the people you will have to champion it you will have to start showing what the opposition is doing we have done protests across petrol pumps uh I will just share a small uh you know this is this is the Karnataka Congress Mahila Congress I think they have put out uh this in public places this shows this gives you a comparison of prices during our regime and this regime i mean this is the word this is the voice of the people you will have to start carrying it to the people i don't think that is being done enough this government when you ask them on onion prices the finance minister turns and says mai lesson pyaaz nahi khati hu to baki log to khate hain is desh mein you ask them on petrol they said uber se chaliye you ask them on jobs they said pakode taliye i think the government of the day needs to be accountable i said we are trying to spread the word and we need help of people like you we need the media to be more vigilant and i and i must compliment people on the ground are far more vigilant than people who decide the policies sitting in studios so i think the media media needs to be more vigilant you need to hold the government of the day accountable because prices can be brought down it is not as if crude is at 150 why are we paying 109 for our petrol and like we said we will raise it in parliament we will continue to hit the street with it i just hope that you will show us a lot more than you are right now I think somebody here had a yeah. question. question. Sure, sure. Okay, I think Modi's government has done. The main guy, Bada Chen, who has done the petrol, diesel, some of the other things. Modi's government, Bada Chen. 
ऐसा ही ना फैमिली में दो बच्चे ही करना तीसरा बच्चा करे तो तो गवर्नमेंट के काम नहीं नहीं अभी मोदी सरकार की ओर से ऑर्डर नहीं आया तो पहले तो मैं वो क्लैरिफाई करना चाहूँगी और मैंने इस बात का जवाब दिया है कि साइंटिफिक डेटा प्रूफ करता है कि हमारी पॉपुलेशन ऑलरेडी 10-12 साल बढ़ेगी और उसके बाद वो ऑलरेडी 40-45 करोड़ लोग खत्म हो जाएंगे उसमें से इक्कीस दो तक हमारी पॉपुलेशन सौ करोड़ हो जाएगी टोटल फर्टिलिटी रेट और रिप्लेसमेंट लेवल कितने लोग एक जनरेशन से मृत्यु हो रही है और कितने नए जन्म हो रहा है वो एक बराबर होता जा रहा है टोटल फर्टिलिटी रेट सिर्फ 2.1 है हिंदुस्तान की बहुत सारे शहर बहुत सारे प्रांत ऐसे हैं बहुत सारे स्टेट्स ऐसे हैं जहाँ पर वो लेवल वन से भी नीचे चला गया है सिक्किम वगैरह में वन है लेवल तो हर परिवार एक बच्चा पैदा कर रहा है तो ये सिर्फ डाइवर्जनरी टैक्टिक है आप अगर साइंटिफिक डेटा देखिए जहाँ पर गरीबी कम होगी जहाँ पर शिक्षा ज़्यादा होगी वहाँ बच्चे कम अपने आप प्रोड्यूस होंगे आपकी रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी है कि आप नौकरियाँ बनाइए आपकी रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी है आप गरीबी कम करिए उसको कम करने के बजाय आप सिर्फ मुद्दा भटकाने के लिए फिर से ये बातें कर रहे हैं इस बात का कोई भी ना सच से ताल्लुक है और ना गवर्नेंस से ताल्लुक है डान थैंक यू वेरी मच That's okay. Just we've done this now.